Brian here with HelpSellMyRV.com out of Louisville, Kentucky, where all RVs are for sale by owner. I'm going to do a walk around today on this beautiful mint condition 2022 Forest River Primetime Avenger 27 RBS travel trailer with the super slide and the outside kitchen. Overall exterior length is 33 feet 6 inches and the exterior height is going to be right around 10 feet 8 inches and the unloaded vehicle weight when it came off the assembly line there's a sticker here on the door and there's also a sticker on the frame uh, where you hitch up and I'll try to show you that and that is how you usually will find the dry weight or empty weight unloaded vehicle weight whatever you want to call it when it came off the assembly line it weighed exactly 6,558 pounds this is a one owner camper the only reason why the owner is selling it is because she does not use it she actually bought this and stayed in it for a couple of months until she settled down with her boyfriend into a, a permanent residence but anyway uh, they called me here a couple months ago and uh, it's in January here and we're getting ready to have the RV and boat show uh, in January 25th in Louisville so I wanted to get this listed so uh, here we go this is going to be the 27 RBS floor plan RBS stands for rear bath slide it's going to be the largest pretty much largest bath you're going to get in this kind of floor plan lots of storage and hopefully i'll justify that in this video medicine cabinet not just a mirror huge storage by the way and this is all above that outside kitchen You do have seating there in the shower, which is nice. Huge shower, by the way. If you know anything about RV showers, this is actually twice as big, almost twice as big as a regular stand-up shower that you'll find in this line of camper. And again, more storage. And you do have the foil wrap countertops all throughout. six gallon gas electric direct spark ignition water heater here's one of your switches here for gas and electric flip, flip a switch on whether you're boondocking or hooked up to shore power uh, you'll have hot water within 15 minutes and these are going to be your monitors monitor panel here the battery i believe the battery it's winter time the battery's kind of uh, got a low charge on it but your holding tanks i believe the, the toilet which is the black tank is going to be a 30 gallon and your gray tank which is your sink and your shower i believe that's going to be 30 gallon and your freshwater tank i do believe it's going to be a 36 or 38 gallon that's what they were in 2020. this is going to be the huge super slide it's going to be a good 12 to 14 foot long I'd say more of 14 foot long. Accommodates the hide a bed sleeper sofa. It's the jackknife, and that all comes out. And uh, you can sleep definitely four in here, and obviously two in the master bedroom. So you can sleep up to six, depending on if they're kids or adults. And that fabric is going to be. It's kind of like I call it that patio fabric kind of sort of that you find outside it's like a water resistant stain resistant and it's all in excellent condition nice LED light accent and the cup holder is there and the colors I guess it's like a tan or kind of a tannish color and you do have uh, blackout shades all throughout huge u-shaped booth dinette one of the largest booth dinettes you're going to get and this does break down into a huge bed easily sleep two adults on this comfortably this table just collapses down and braces up right here and then you get the idea and again fabrics are in excellent condition i guess the owner had a little doggy or something a little doggy door but uh, if you wanted to get that out you could just take it out and i just get a little panel that matches the wood and just cover that right up It'd be a non-issue and then get another panel and put it right there make it match your window treatment's going to be like a silk 
finish on the curtains here. And then it's like a wood grain. It's like an ultra leather wrap. Huh, but it looks like wood. Pretty cool. Okay. Pan around here. The kitchen, this is going to be that foil wrap countertop again. Lots of countertop space, by the way. Uh, farmer sink, undermounted farmer sink. Glass lid on top of your three burner gas cooktop for more counter space. The three burner cooktop, front burner, usually a high output for boiling hot water. Nice LED light accent. The owner did say everything goes with the camper. So all the dishes, everything you see in this video on the camper, if it's in the video, it's yours, whoever buys it. And again, lots of counter space or uh, storage space, cabinet space. I believe it's a 10.5, 12 volt refrigerator. Ten point five cubic inch or cubic foot, and then your flat screen TV. Uh, it's going to be about a, I'd say about a forty eight inch flat screen, and this is in storage mode now. But you just unclip this, and this TV should pivot out, angle in any direction. Actually, placed perfectly for this floor plan. A lot of floor plans, the TV like will be like not in the best uh, place for the particular floor plan but this is perfect and this is Bluetooth capable stereo uh, HDMI USB hookups and you have USB hookups I believe in the bedroom too which I'll show you It's going to be your 13,500 BTU AC unit with, with, with the quick dump feature. And uh, once you get to the campsite, open up these louvers, do the quick dump for a couple of minutes, shut the louvers off, and you'll have ducted AC all throughout. Your furnace is going to be, I believe, a 30,000 BTU furnace, more than enough for this floor plan. I'm tracking in leaves. If you see any little spots on the carpet, that's just me tracking in the leaves right now. But uh, this, I've put this up against any 2022-23 model all day long. No wear at all. Nice pocket door for privacy from the master bedroom into the living room. And you have a nice size fully walk around queen bed. See, So you got a lot of room. Usually the bed will be snugged up to the wall. Storage up underneath, and I'm doing this with one arm. And of course, lots and lots of storage play space, closet space. I do check all campers for water damage. Check in the corners. Open up any cabinets. Look for any wrinkling in the wallpaper. Did not find any issues. This uh, trailer passed with flying colors. USB charging or smart device charging right there. And you do have a 110 outlet right there, and you also have one on the other side. Right there. The owner put these little things in. Oh, they're in the bathroom too. I thought they were shelves. I'm going to have to ask her what that's for. Anyway, your TV would go right there. And it's cable and satellite prepped in here. And there's your little backer plate. So if you want to put a mount here, that's where you put it. High traffic area is going to be that residential grade vinyl flooring. It's that wood plank floor look. All right. Then you got the buttons for your awning which is 16 foot power awning and your slide out button there and then your lights. And it is easy to figure out. All right, let's go outside. 
look at this nice little area when you first walk in if you want to keep something like flashlights or something like that in there all right the sun is shining and i always forget to point out anytime they have this solid step or step above system this is that solid uh, step entry step that folds away inside the door nice and clean look sturdier than your traditional uh, rv camper steps 16 foot power awning all your led lights are working by the way always like to point that out this is that corrugated aluminum skin and on these corrugated aluminum skins the first thing i look for is any dinks in the in the aluminum and i did not find any at all again i would put this up against any brand new 2000 or used 2022 2023 all day long and again the, the this is only been used for a couple months and it was actually parked in one spot so this really doesn't have many many miles on it so you're not going to get any rock any road issues or anything like that nice uh prime time avenger badge there all the decals again excellent condition uh two 20 pound lp tanks with cover power uh hitch i believe that was an option and like this you get that with the camper you are solar prepped on this this is all up underneath the bed nice service light up underneath there and again huge storage on this floor plan this does have the heavy duty stabilizer jacks all the way around four of them two in the front two in the back these are the ones you want those little electric ones in my opinion are junk they're rinky dink there's your fully enclosed heated underbelly and it's heated by the radiant heat from the uh, duct work in the floor. So your holding tanks are all protected. You can go into extended seasons on this camper. That's your six gallon water heater. There's, I believe again, your 30,000 BTU furnace. Nice little hand warmer there at your exhaust. Dexter Easy Lube axles. Pop the little center hubs off here on the axles and you can grease your axles here. You don't have to take it in and get service, which is nice. See these? It comes with a camper. You don't have to go out and buy them. Outside marine speakers. And again, see? Excellent condition. That's another thing I'll look for when I'm looking at the outside. Immediately look at, look at the, um, the vinyl, the graphics on it. Outside kitchen, never been used. Look at that. The leaf. Absolutely never has been used. Looks like little cork placemats. And again, it goes with it. All this goes with the camper if you want it. Little like two or three cubic foot dorm fridge. Electric, just plug it in. Little outlet there dedicated for the refrigerator. And then you got another one right there, which is nice. All right. Little D rings to chain down your dogs or tie them down or pets. Spare tire. They don't usually give that away. It's usually part of a package, but that's nice. Spare tire. And you are prepped for backup camera up there. tires in excellent condition the only miles that are on the tires is when that came from Elkhart Indiana to a local dealer here in Louisville and then from the local dealer to where they parked it right here and that's it it's not been anywhere else on the road the owners put those little peel and stick window decorative window things so people can't really see in they'll come off real easy you just peel them right off on the inside I like it it's pretty cool and on these aluminum corrugated skins, that's why one of the reasons why I do my videos on a nice sunny day so I can shoot down the side and see if I can see any dinks in the metal. Here, look at that, see? Just do that, look for any dinks in the metal. Outside shower, hot and cold running water, city water hookup, uh, cable hookup here, 30 amp service. There's gonna be your hookups. Those are all your dump valves right there. 
and there's your other dump valve so it looks like your kitchen that's your gray tank for the kitchen and this is going to be your gray for the shower and your black for the toilet and you got nice low point drain valves here so it's easy to winterize Uh, the window tinting, I'm not sure if it's 80% tin or not. Usually it is. And they put the privacy peel-on stick in the bedroom too. So in the bedroom and in the bathroom. So you, you can take them off if you want. They just peel right off. Black tank sewer flush flushes out your toilet tank. And then here's your... Uh, uh, fresh water fill your potable water uh, i believe it's good again uh, 36 maybe 38 gallon fresh water tank on this and this is your storage in the back side and everything you see here comes with all right and this is going to be your other sticker that tells you what the weight is and usually if you don't find them on the door look right here where the where you hitch up on the frame on the Lippert frame and there it is and there's your VIN number oh, solar prep right here trickle charges your battery and you do have the diamond plating on the front I think I got everything look at that right when I'm finishing up the video the Sun shines right on it pretty nice okay nice camper uh, if you want to come see the camper, call the number on the ad, or you can call 502-645-3124. Uh, if you like this video, I'd appreciate if you give it a thumbs up. If you have a comment, leave it below. And if you want to keep up to date on RVs coming for sale by owner in the Louisville, Kentucky area, you can always follow HelpSellMyRV.com on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube.